Are you surprised about the timeline on that? One day shy of three weeks after the fiery, toxic derailment of a Norfolk Southern train in East Palestine, U.S. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg toured the site and the community on Thursday, some critical of him waiting too long. You know, what I tried to do was balance two things. My desire to be involved and engaged and on the ground, which is uh, uh, how I am uh, generally wired to act, and my desire to follow the norm of transportation secretaries, allowing NTSB to really uh, lead the initial stages. With Rudy Giuliani and others also in town, the transportation secretary meeting with East Palestine mayor. The day after a visit by former President Trump, Buttigieg critical deregulation, he said happened during the Trump administration. If the same people who want to come here and play political games are the same people, who sided with industry again and again and again and watered down rail regulations again and again and again. I want to see where they've had an actual change of heart or not. As the cleanup at the toxic site continues, many residents still fear for the long-term effects on the environment. The Ohio Department of Natural Resources on Thursday revising the number of fish killed over a seven and a half mile stretch of local waterways. We would estimate that over the um, affected site, a total of 38,222, what we would refer to as minnows, were potentially killed as a result of the derailment. The best way to deal with an ecological disaster is to stop it from happening in the first place. So when the cars are coupling up, if one would override the other. The Transportation Secretary on Thursday proposing regulatory changes, including additional notification to communities of a hazardous train, stronger tank cars for hazardous chemicals, and requirements for the number of people on each train. This one had three people on it. The railroad companies want to be able to take it down to one. Knowing regulation takes time, Buttigieg responding to a Fox 8 question about what can be done immediately to make rail transportation safer. What we can do immediately is uh, a level of elevated, focused inspection based on what we've learned from this situation. Because you're exactly right. These, these regulatory processes can take forever. In East Palestine, Dave Nethers, Fox 8 News.